What's going on everyone? Welcome to another video. Can't be that loud because Brady's downstairs taking a nap and Shelby is at Target because she forgot wrapping paper. We went to Target the other day and we went there for wrapping paper and of course we went there, we got everything but wrapping paper. So she had to go back and she's also picking up some like stocking stuffers for Brady and myself. Look at this room. Brady comes up here and destroys my office every single time. So Austin today is actually kind of cold. Uh, it has been around 60 to 70 degrees here uh, in Texas, but today it's like 40 degrees and I love this kind of weather. I do not think winter time should be warm, so that's why I'm wearing my long sleeve ZV shirt. And then we'll be going to the gym here in a little bit when Shelby gets back uh, from Target. So I asked all you guys in my last video to give me ideas on what to video. So so these videos will be very interesting. I said videos like too many times in that one uh, sentence. But anyways, the top video idea was to do a full day of eating while on a bulk because a lot of people have questions as far as what my macros are, what my calories are when I'm bulking. So they want to see a full day of eating. So I'll be filming that sometime this week. So I'll be looking for that video. Check this out. I am in the new trainer magazine with Arnold on the cover. And this is my leg program from bodybuild.com. So I have a full page of the program. If you wanna check out the new leg program, I think it came out maybe two weeks ago. Uh, scroll down to the description box, I have a link to it down there. I'm telling you, it is an awesome program. Now I hear Brady, so let's go in there and get that little man up. But before I go get Mr. Brady, I got to make some coffee because it's so hard to do anything with that little kid walking around getting into everything. All right, so when that's making, let's go get little man. Shelby said this is the meanest thing, turning on the lights. <laughs> but he doesn't care. He doesn't care. Say hello, vlog. Everyone loves you, Brady. They said, more Brady. All the comments are saying, need more of Brady in the videos. What do you think about that? What do you think? You got your Woody costume on? Yeah, did you have a good nap? Did you have a good nap? Fist bump. Yeah, there you go. Come on, let's go. We just taught him to fist bump last night and he is loving it. So now he can high five and fist bump. Right, Brady? Right? Yeah, you can do all that. You are so smart. <laughs> so smart, yeah. He's looking for mom now. Mom's not here. Mom's not here. She went to Target. <laughs> Oh, I forgot to show you what Bernard was up to this morning. Check it out. He is getting into nothing but trouble now. He is making lemonade, 25 cents lemonade. Oh my gosh, he is peeing in the cup and selling it as lemonade. That is lemonade that I do not want, Bernard. Do you want the lemonade? No, you do not want that lemonade, believe me. Oh man, I got so much to do as far as Christmas shopping. How many of y'all comment down below? Because I want to know if anyone is completely done with Christmas shopping. Because every year we try to do it as early as possible, but we always end up panicking when Amazon won't ship anything before Christmas. So it's right at the deadline of Amazon because we're like, oh my gosh, we gotta order it right now or it's not gonna be here before Christmas. And it's so hard because all my brothers and sisters are all different ages. And when they're at those ages, every year they want something different. Yeah. Right? Uh. Yeah, what do you want for Christmas? What do you want for Christmas? You already have your two front teeth. <laughs> what else do you want? Milk? Oh yeah, I should have never said that word. He is headed to the fridge now. Why did I say that? I don't even know if we have milk right now. What do you want? You want coffee? You want coffee? I don't think you want coffee. What do you want? Milk? I don't, where's your cup? Where's your cup? Where's your cup? Well, he might be badly disappointed because the only thing we have right now is almond milk. Let's see if you like some hippie milk, Brady. He's had this once before and he really didn't like it because what we give him is whole milk. And Shelby's at the grocery store right now because we're out of milk and this is all we have. So we're gonna see if he likes it now. There you go. Get a sip of that and see. What do you think? Is it good? 
Okay, well, maybe, uh, I don't know. Is it good? Do you like it? So Shelby's back from Target and the grocery store, and I wanna show you something before I go to the gym. So a couple sent me some fan art, I had some fan art made for me, uh, Christine and Curtis Barnes. So thank you so much for this. This is the coolest thing. Check it out. All framed up and everything. So this photo is from my cover photo with Muscle and Fitness. I think it's pretty awesome. Whoever made this did a really great job. So this is gonna be hanging up in my office. They also sent me a very nice letter as well. So if you're watching this, thank you. <laughs> so if you're watching this, thank y'all so much. So this is evidence that he does not like almond milk because it's been about 30 minutes and he still has not finished this, but he's gonna cry when I take it away from him. I'm gonna put real milk in it, okay? Look, you want some real milk? The good stuff. You want the good stuff, don't you? Okay. Here you go. Try that. Now the first sip is going to be almond milk, so don't trust it. But after that, it's real milk. What do you think? Is it good? Is it good? Is it good? Is it good? Now we're going to see if Gainer likes almond milk because I put it in his bowl. Gainer, come on. Try the almond milk. So again, thank you, Curtis and Christine. I'm gonna have to find a space on this wall for that photo. And thank you so much for the note. It really means a lot. Uh, through this note they sent me, uh, it says that I inspire them, inspire so many, so they wanted to do something nice for me. So I really do appreciate it. So I'm about to do a little bit more work on the computer and then head to the gym. Today is gonna be a back day. Now I know I just posted a back workout maybe two videos back, but it's not my fault because this is just my program and I can't really do much about it. Now I know I need to post an arm workout and I don't want all these videos being the exact same muscle groups. Shake it. So Brady's shaking up my pre-workout and we're about to head to the gym. So I couldn't decide on what gym I want to go to uh, because I like working back at Gold's Gym but it's five o'clock and Gold's Gym at five o'clock is gonna be so packed. Now the other gym I go to body wise is a great gym but their dumbbells don't go over 100 pounds and they don't have all the equipment like Gold's Gym has but body wise I'm able to bring a whole tripod in there and get really good angles. So I'm thinking to go to body wise to go in there and get it taken care of. So now we're gonna head to the gym and get this back workout started. What's going on everyone? I hope you're all enjoying the video. So let's go ahead and jump straight into this workout. So I found this workout actually on bodybuilding.com. This is by Hunter Labrada. And of course I had to modify it a little bit. I had to add a few more exercises and more sets because I like to do a little bit more volume than what this program has on it. So let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So I started off with the super set. It was straight arm pull downs, uh, four sets of around 12 to 15 reps, super set with seated cable rows. So I would go straight from the straight arm into the cable uh, rows and I was going for around 15 reps with the uh, rows as well. And so what I'm trying to do here is stretch forward and then bring that cable back, try to bring my elbows as far back as I can, squeezing throughout every single rep. So after that went into underhand cable pull downs, I did four sets of around 10 to 12 reps and on the last set I did a double drop set. So I would just drop the weight by around 20% and try to squeeze out another maybe five to six reps, anything until failure. And then moved on to reverse grip bent over rows. I did four sets of eight to 10 reps and on the last set I did a double drop set. So on this program on bodybuilding.com he does not do any drop sets and most of all the sets are only three sets instead of like four to five, which is totally fine to do if you're not used to my type of volume. Uh, you could always just do exactly what this program has on it on bodybuilding.com. After that, went into more pull downs. I did close grip pull downs, uh, four sets of around 10 to 12 reps and on the last set of course I had to do a double drop set and that is actually the last exercise that Hunter did uh, in this workout but of course like I said I had to add a few more exercises so after that we went into dumbbell incline bench row I did five sets of around 10 to 12 reps and on the last set did a double drop set and then the last back exercise I did was a chest supported uh, row on a machine and I did five sets 
of around 10 to 12 reps. And on the last set, I did a triple drop set on here. The reason why I did a triple on here is because it's so easy to strip off the weight. If I was doing it with dumbbells, I'd have to tote the dumbbells over there. And it's just a pain in the butt. But with a machine like this, you can just easily pull off plates. So what I would do is just go to failure and then drop a 25 pound and then go to failure again, drop a 25 and then take off the 45 and then put a 25 on there and then go to failure again. And then I finished off on calves. I only did five sets of these for around 10 to 12 reps. Right now, like I said in my last video, I'm doing calves just about three times a week. I alternate between calves and abs and I really want to focus on bringing up my calves in this off season. So that's why I'm working them so much. But guys, that is the end of the workout. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to give this workout a try, it'll be written down in the description box. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. So just made it home and Shelby's cooking dinner. Uh, we're having curry tonight with that non bread that Shelby always makes. It's delicious. And Brady's here in his robe. Brady, how you feeling? How was he? He was good. He was good? Well, well that's he good. He let me, I mean, I've been Instagramming and he's Letting me. Awesome. Well, he's in a better mood. And then she's adding something a little bit different than what we've been having lately. Ooh. She's adding some of these small potatoes that she put in the oven and they taste really good in the curry. So now I'm going to go take a shower and then eat in about, I guess, an hour or something. What? No, we're almost done. Oh, okay. Well, yay. So I got a shower and Shelby finished up dinner, but we're gonna put Mr. Brady to bed before dinner so that we can sit down and enjoy dinner without him trying to grab our food. And then we're gonna watch some Christmas movies. And then I'm gonna read over my last video's comments about y'all's ideas on the videos because I got a lot and I think some of them are good and me and Shelby's gonna discuss them after dinner. You ready for bed? Oh, you mad. Okay, yeah, he's, 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 ready, for bed. he's ready for bed. So we're done eating and now I'm going to read over some of these ideas on my YouTube uh, channel. Some of them are pretty funny actually. I think they'd be uh, pretty good to do. Uh, Shelby had me change up the camera angle because before I had it facing the door and stuff and she's like, why don't you get the Christmas decorations in the background? So I had to switch it all around. Are you satisfied now? We have a table saw next to our back door right now. Shh. I wasn't going to say that, but Shelby just told on herself. Yeah, we have a on saw. On myself. I didn't use it. <laughs> we have a table saw in the kitchen uh, because we still have not put that thing up in the attic uh, because it is not going to fit in our mini garage. So we're going to have to stick it upstairs sometime this Tomorrow. week. <laughs> All right, so let's read over some of these uh, comments and ideas. Christmas is about remembering the birth of Jesus and maybe make a nativity scene. For a vlog? Yes, it's all about Jesus and the birth of Jesus, but I'm not sure how we'd make Maybe that we should vlog. buy one. Buy a nativity and then build it? That's um. an idea. Brady is taking over your vlog. Best Christmas memories. So are they wanting me to do like Christmas memories? Like talk about Christmas memories? Best Christmas memories question mark, so yeah. Okay, that'd be a good video topic, I guess. Seems like Abel and Shelby have already outgrown their house. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh gosh, if we did, we're in trouble. Is the ping pong table so yeah. big? How about a question and answer series? Most of us would like some tips. I've done different question and answers. I guess I could do another one. How to get gym and family balance over Christmas would be a good one. What does that mean? How do you balance your time with oh, family. your family versus at the gym, which actually would probably be a good topic for when we visit your family because it's way harder when we're in Mississippi. Yeah, definitely way harder. Oh, they like the house improvements. Me too. High calorie burn workout to get ready for the holiday feasting. <laughs> that is going <laughs> to be a ton of working out. <laughs> yeah, there's no prepping for that. <laughs> there was a tutorial on YouTube on how to assemble the ping pong table, you know. <laughs> Listen, that's the only reason he figured out that he had been doing it wrong for like an hour. I came upstairs and pulled up the YouTube video and I was like, um... Video idea. Take Shelby to a store. Everything she touches, you have to buy. Heck no. I saw this comment. Heck already. no. I commented back to it. Because she would go to Target and buy everything in Target. That is a terrible video idea. I do not like your comment, David. Do a full day of eating to show us your bulking diet. I talked about that already, and that comment came up like three times. Do a series of question and answer 
on Insta, please? Well, this is YouTube. I can't do a question and answer on my YouTube channel if I'm doing it on Instagram. Maybe I'll ask the questions on Instagram like I did before and then answer them on a YouTube video. More of baby Brady dancing. Everyone wants to see that little kid dance. A video on Gainer's life story. <laughs> what do you think about that, Gain? Gainer, what do you think? You think we should do a video series on you? Yeah, I think he would love that. Actually, not at all. No. He is not... Um, he didn't do a whole lot with his life. No, he doesn't. He sleeps, eats, and farts. <laughs> That's about it. Do the one chip challenge from... I don't know how you say that. I do not know what the one chip challenge is. We're gonna have to look that up. So what is this one chip challenge? Pocky or Packy, I don't know, is the brand, but it's like a package with one chip in oh. it, and it's the world's hottest chip. Heck it it's no, made I the Carolina Reaper. Do not do heat very well. And it doesn't all. even like when we make the curry, <laughs> we have to get the mild one because. Maybe order it. I'll prove you wrong. We need to order them. We'll try the one chip challenge. We nothing. Oh, you're not gonna do it. No. If I can do it or try, you're you gonna do it. You can't do it. You're gonna throw up. Well, then I'm gonna throw up for the vlog. Well, that's disgusting. <laughs> Do you have a home gym? I don't know why I'm answering questions here. This is for <laughs> video ideas, but no, I don't have a home gym. I got a elliptical and we're planning on getting some like gym equipment up there. But right now all we have is elliptical. Do food challenges. Yeah, we could do food challenges for sure. We just got to think of different ideas on food challenges because you just can't be like a food challenge. Here we go. We're going to eat all this. Make a vid on couple workout. People ask about that they a lot. They do ask about that an awful lot. Shelby has not worked out in months, so any workout right now would kick her butt. Not months. It's been a while. <laughs> it's been a long time <laughs> since she's been to the gym. She's got it on the elliptical, yeah. but not to the gym. Please make bulking diet food recipes video. Okay, so recipes like you... for diet. Okay. Abel is the goat. That's right. Brady is the goat. <laughs> Brady's the goat. <laughs> Truth and dare video. How would that work? Like I'm, I would dare you to do something yeah. or truth? Yeah. Huh, that I'm would be very terrible. interesting for a video. Even like as a little kid, I'm t I was terrible at truth or dare because I can't come up with any. <laughs> <laughs> Try different countries' foods each vlog at different restaurants. Ooh, I like that. That's a good ethnic. idea. That's a good idea. Yeah, so I think we got a lot of good ideas uh, through the comments and stuff. So thank you everyone that gave us these ideas. I'm going to continue to look through them and stuff and then we need to pick them uh, for the videos and stuff coming up. Because like I said, I want these videos to be as entertaining as possible, not just like everyday just random things that we do around the house. I know some of y'all like that, but I like to have kind of like a topic for my videos. Well, I'm gonna end the video here. Thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe and also hit that bell because that will notify you each time I upload a new video. And I know you don't wanna miss these Vlogmas videos. But guys, thank you so much and I'll see y'all next time. All right guys, peace. What? I read that word wrong. I put two S's. <laughs>